Hello, my friends. Welcome back. Today, I'm going to share with you my kit lineup for the month of April. I'm super excited because I'm also going to show you my new little planner system here. So this is how I am keeping all of my kits that I'm going to be using for this month. Um, not this month, next month, because it's still March when I'm doing this. Obviously, it's St. Patrick's Day. Um, this is going to stay on my desk and it has all the kits in it that I need. So when it's time for me to do my plan with me and I want to get my week ready to go. I've got everything in here ready to go. It's separated by weeks and by planner. And then I can just grab my functionals and my extras and all of my little tools and then just start to go. So this is just going to sit right on my table. So this binder, I showed it in a haul, got it on Amazon. It came in a three pack. There's three different colors. These are the dividers that just came in. I just hauled these, um, but you haven't seen it yet because the haul is going to go up at the end of the month, but it's a part of the haul. This also came from Amazon and these are top tab. They also have side tab available, but I got the top tab ones. And then these pockets are super thick, super thick. So you can stuff. So you can make these some pretty chunky, pretty chunky um, pockets with your kits that you're planning on using for the month if you want to store them this way. And I split it up as in, because I have two main planners that I use, but I also have other planners that I use that you guys know. I use my Coco Daisy which is my TN planner, sometimes for like daily journaling. And then I also have the daily journaling part of the TPC planner. And I also have, um, it's my mostly just my PR planner, but the B6. But someday I might actually want to film in that, but I also can keep my kits in here if I wanted to. So I have it set up for you. I have the TPC planner and I have it set where this is week one and week two. So week one and week two. Week, this is the three and four, so week three and week four, and then the A and N planner, same thing. And then I have the last tab for like miscellaneous stuff, which is like Coco Daisy, whatnot. And then this little guy is my some little thing. So this was from the magical planner um, bundle that we got. And it's just, I have two of them. Let me grab the other one so I can show you what it looks like before I turned it into a pocket. So it just comes like this, and it's thick. And all I did was use my punch and I did the three hole punch. And on the inside, I have these pockets. They're clear pockets, they're sticky. I stick them to either side on the inside of the, the thing here. Punch it with the punch and then I've got pockets for, so these are all kits that I'm currently using in my planner that I'm still writing with or like monthlies that are coming up if I want to use any of the leftovers. So in here, like if I wanted to use Honey Dukes, I might want to use the extras from Honey Dukes for like a daily spread. Um, this is Plants vs. Zombies is in here and then my Cruella kit. So those are the ones that I'm currently still using and I may make into daily kits if I want to. So that being said and being done, let's go through the kits. So for the first week of April in my TPC planner, I had to do this. And I'm sorry about the sweatshirt, but I am cold. I'm going to pull out week one and week two. I'm kind of set this guy off to the side. I also keep this in there like a little thing to remind me of what the dates are. Because if you know, I forget. <laughs> I forget what the heck date it is for the week that I'm on. So this is the Cherry Blossom Kit. And this one is by Happy Daya. And this is the other little trick. If you get washi in your kits, like now Avalon and Ninth is doing it, um... Happy Daya does it, some little thing. It, everybody's doing it. Even I'm planning on doing washi. A lot of times you can forget what washi goes with what kit, like if it's specifically made to go with the kit. So I just take like a little piece of scrap paper. I take the washi strips. I put them on a little piece of paper and then I keep them in the, in the pocket with the kit because I have like 550,000 rolls of washi. And so when I go looking for it, sometimes it's not always obvious which washi goes with what kit. So this is how I am trying to be more organized and actually be able to use the 550,000 rolls of washi that I'm collecting. So there's the washi that goes with this kit and it's sitting over there in my washi cabinet. Someday I'm going to show you the washi cabinet. And then here are all of the pages. So some of, with the Happy Day kits, you get a ton of stuff. Probably enough to do more than one week. I've done usually what I do with it, and that's why I chose the TPC planner for this, is I'll do my week, and then I'll do like a whole week of dailies behind it. But since once this TPC planner runs out, which it runs out very soon, I'm not going to have the daily pages anymore. It's going to be um, just the weekly and I'm going back to my Coco Daisy um, for the daily stuff. So I probably won't be needing the extras, but that doesn't mean that I can't save it for another week. Plenty, plenty in here to do two weeks. You get both foiled and unfoiled. So I'm just going to go through it, show you. 
So these are your little check boxes. Always, always gives you like this little mindfulness kind of stuff, which is like, have the courage to be kind. You're amazing. Cheer up buttercups, like just little positive affirmations, adorable and foiled. And then your little deco sheet. Love using those check boxes. Love her. I love her little movie markies. They're so stinking adorable. Full boxes. Oh, sorry. I got to catch my breath. First of all, I've been running around here like a chicken with my head cut off trying to get stuff done. And I ate way too much for dinner because I hadn't eaten all day. And then you know how you haven't eaten all day and you're like starving to death and then you wolf it down and then you try to do a whole bunch of stuff. And now I'm just like so stuffed I can't even breathe. So anyway, look at how stinking adorable this kid is. Life is full of beauty. Let your dreams blossom. It's just so stinking cute, like a little playing out in the yard with the cherry blossoms falling. So obviously it's cherry blossom season coming up. And this kit is absolutely fantastic. Look at your date covers. So stinking cute. And your washies. I just love it. I love it, love it, love it. And then here's your extra boxes and your Mondays through Sundays. A whole bunch of those. You can't run out of those even if you try. And then you're into the non-foiled pages, which I kind of mix and match them so that that way I can use both foiled and non-foiled together. And then one week isn't sad because there's no foil. Here's another set of washi, another set of date covers, another adorable weekend banner. Here's a ton of deco, not deco, icons for everything from taking out the trash to making little food, paydays, all kinds of stuff. I use all of that. These I use as my work days right here where it says hours. Those are the ones I use for my work days. And then you've got some extras here. You've got labels, big deco, half boxes, full boxes, and then all your to-dos, todays, and your dividers, which is stinking adorable. So this kit right here is for the first week in um did I, get, did I show you all of it oh yeah i did so this one is for the first week in my tpc planner so i'll set that one off to the side now for the second week i decided to use this kit here and this is going to be a trial for me so this kit is a mini kit. So it's something new that I'm trying out in my shop with my own art. And mini kits only have four pages. And you know me, I'm a no white space planner. But I did look and see, and the newest March um, functional from Avalon and Ninth is pretty much the same colors. So I'm going to probably pull from that. But this is the TPC, so that's why I'm using it in my TPC. So this is like the sidebar for the TPC Nation Planner. Then here's all the full boxes. And these have all Cocoa and Fluff and little baby chicks and all this stuff. It's really cute. And I thought it would be a really cute way to, um, wait a minute. Yeah, this is week number two. <laughs> Sorry. I'm like, wait a minute. It's not Easter. It is. Actually, Easter is on the 17th. And so this will be the final, you know, so that Sunday ends this week. So that's why this is for that week. So this is the Easter kit that I'm using. The washi page, which is adorable, and date covers. And then this is like the new format for the mini kits. So just so you can kind of get an idea of what you're looking at when you get mini kits from me. This is exactly the layout that all of them are going to be. There's a lot of like functional things with some work labels in here, bill dues, your weekly spending, like a tracking, to do's, today's importance, etc. Here's your numbers. Some more decorative boxes with little check things beside them. So they're just really cute, easy boxes. I mean, easy kit to use. Four pages, not a lot. It's a really easy format if you're not like wanting 500 pages. Um, and then this is the add-on. If you have the TPC, I figured it was kind of silly to add it in since not everybody has a TPC planner. And then you're looking at these little rounded boxes like, what on earth do I do with that? So this is an add-on. And then not going to use a lot of foil. But I thought this one was really pretty. So it's a mixed metal. It's like a rose gold and a, it's matte for sure. But it's kind of like a rose gold and a silver matte. And these are just the dividers. Um, yeah, these are just the dividers. So that's what I'm going to use. I didn't want a whole lot of foil on this one because I just didn't think anything would go because it's so busy. But I thought that would be cute. So that is for the second week. Then let's flip the page. I love this little, this little setup is so awesome. We got some planning with Manny. Ah, I love this. 
this is going to be an awesome month. I have some of the most beautiful kits that I have ever had in my collection being used in April. So we're going to start with planning with Manny. So this one is for the week of the 18th through the 24th. And this is her Easter kit. So I figured, you know, I had like four Easter kits and I wanted to use them all. So here we go. Here we go. So look at how stinking adorable this is. So here's all of your full boxes. This one's called Easter Fun. And your page two, with all your date covers and your, uh, look at these. Just, just, uh, just love this. Look at this washi. Mm -hmm. Yep, it's adorable. This is gonna be so cute. So stinking cute. And then these are my favorites. Like I love these little TVs, which she already knows I love these TVs. Still waiting for them to add them to the shop as their own little thing that I can buy so I can mark all of my TV fun. And then this little pocket is adorable and it's going in my planner. And then <laughs> look at this die cut. It's just the cutest thing ever and I'm gonna use it. That's why it's on my TPC one is because I'm gonna use this. It's gonna go on one of the daily spreads. So I'm gonna attach it to the daily. So that's why I'm using it in my TPC. Dividers and check boxes. And then these are different, but these are like stamp size, little small stamp size boxes. And I thought they would be really cute to like put the weather in for the week. I thought that was cute. Your days of the week. This is adorable. Peter Cottontail, <laughs> it's like all flat lays. Adorable, that's something new. I don't think I've seen her do flat lays before. And then some more like deco stuff and dividers. I love this, love that. And then you've got some little character sheet. So this is for more Easter fun stuff. No foil for this one. I don't want to use foil because it's a very colorful kit. It does not need any help. It is adorable. So there is that one. Then for the next week, uh, this kit. So this is for the last week of April, which runs all the way to the 1st of May. This one is going to have some foil, but only dividers. Nothing else. I'm not going to sneeze, but give me a second. It's like thinking about it. But look at how, oh, jeez, look at the colors on this. Oh, this is so fantastic. This is Kitty Friends. Some extra full boxes that I got. I uh, love this. I love this. Paper Candy Art is now going to be on my every week have to buy from, not every week, but every month. You know how I do. You know how I do my sales and stuff, but I have to pick up from them like all the time. Phenomenal color. The cut is perfect. It's on the perfect kind of paper. It's unicorn paper. This is just absolutely fantastic. I'm in love. And look at these boxes. They're just like perfect. If you are, remember Hello Kitty, I am not a Hello Kitty kid because Hello Kitty is more like my kids' kind of stuff. But um, I do remember being dragged into the Hello Kitty store every time I went to the mall by my children and having a ton of Hello Kitty stuff around the house. Look at this washi. Holy moly, the color in this thing is unbelievable. This poor girl's got to go through a sh crap ton of ink. <laughs> I'm sorry, but when you print this in this kind of color, you go through ink pretty darn quick. Look at these. Look at this. This is a labor of love. As somebody who used to do this but doesn't do it anymore because I just do not have time to recolor every single icon every week, this is a labor of love, and I love her for it. Fantastic. And then this page. Look at how many pages there are. Another reason why it's going in my TPC one because I can totally use this as dailies because there's just so much here that I've got plenty to use in my daily planner. So this one is for the last week of April starting in May. Colors are gorgeous and maybe, maybe I'll use these. So this is like that pink, that really light pink hollow um, for dividers, maybe. Not sure, I might not. Because it's just so colorful, I don't think I need it. So now let's move on to the A&N planner. The other thing is that, so the a &N planner is going to be more geared towards my mom. So my mom is coming up the, basically like the half. So it's the half of the week of the 11th and then the whole week of the next week. So I decided to kind of do some things that remind me of my mom kind of because I thought it would be fun. So this one here is as a child growing up. So this is going to be for the first week in my A&N planner. And this is by Tilly B Plans. And this is fantastic. I love this. It's called Witch Please. Mm, yes. Oh, yes. Yes, yes, yes. So here are your dividers, the glitter dividers. This is an extra add-on that I added on. Here are your full pages. Oh, I love this. And then it's totally out of order. 
else but you can get the idea of what's in here for the whole entire thing look at this washi oh just love 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 and all of your extra boxes and your check boxes and your little doodle boxes and some more washies so anyway she and i as a kid we didn't have i know i'm totally dating myself but we didn't have vcrs and dvds and stuff like that we watched stuff on tv as a family tv was free everybody had it and every year the wizard of oz would come on can't remember when during the year it was i feel like it was kind of more towards fall where this would come on it's a big deal we would make um she would make i shouldn't say we because i was a kid she would make peanut butter fudge and we would sit and we would watch this together all the time and every single year. And so this totally reminded me of my mom when I saw it. So I had to have it. I had to pick it up. So that is for the first week. And that is kicking off my mom coming to visit. And I'm so excited. So, so excited. Okay. So for the second week, I wanted to do an Easter kit. And so this is the 11th through the 17th. And I decided to go with the Avalon and 9th. So this, I picked this up specifically for Easter for um, the Avalon and 9th planner. So I love this double box. I love the colors. It's just beautiful. And you know, you get 150,000 pages. So there is plenty here. This is my new favorite thing, this little weekly cleaning thing. Here's all of your extra boxes. Love these. This one's got foil as well. I am going to use foil with this kit. Washi and dividers. And then I'm going to use, I thought that the leftovers of the candy one, um, would work so I'm probably not going to use any of the big boxes but I want to use like the dividers and then there's some more candy dividers here and here <laughs> I've got tons of candy and then we've got these that I can use and then there's some more like candy like pieces and then any of the extras that I want to use so this is the silver hollow and I thought the silver hollow would go the best with the pastels and so I don't have boxes to go over these I wish I did but I don't because I've already used this and I don't have any more and I need to pick up some more and but I can definitely use the rest of it so that's that then other story about my mom so the a and planner is basically all my mother <laughs> just throwing it out there Okay, so the 18th through the 24th is when they're actually here. And then this one is not as happy a story, but anything that you do with your parents and it's a fun memory is just something I want to celebrate. My mom used to kick my butt. I played this all the time with her. She was ruthless, ruthless, ruthless. And she never, ever, ever let me win. Never, ever. <laughs> but this for the week that she's here, I thought she would get a kick out of it because she knows. It's not like she doesn't know. She knows because I tell her all the time. She, used, she tried to play it with my kids and my kids were little and my daughter left crying. <laughs> and I told her, I said, you know what? Now you know what I went through. So there. So this one is by Ink Paper Plan. It is foiled goodness. So I do not need any foil to go with it. Here is the, I think this is just all dividers. Yeah, all dividers all your boxes I think there's plenty here so I don't need to bring in any extra boxes but there it is so that kit right there I just realized oh no it does right here washi I'm like is there no washi there is it's right here um this kit is for the week that they actually are here for like the entire week so I thought this was a funny one and she is going to get a kick out of it because I'm going to plan with her here then this is my the 25th to the 1st this one is my baby and I wanted to use it before May because I have a kit coming out in May that I want to use in May. So I wanted to get this one used in April and this is Flower Shop. So here's all the full boxes. I don't have the whole kit here because I just didn't need the whole kit. As you guys know, I give you like 150,000 pages. But here's all of what I am going to be using for the last week. It's super, super cute. I am going to be using the foil. Here's the foil for it. It's so cute. So I've got the foil. And then um, I probably won't use the monthly because I've already done the monthlies in my planner. So I probably won't use the monthlies this time. But that doesn't mean I won't use them later. It's like It's not like it's dated or anything so you can definitely use this whenever you want and then this is the doodle boxes the glitter 
the little things and the extras. So this one is for the last week of the month. And good news, guys, for anybody who, actually, for the people who were messaging me, heads up, I made too many of these. So I do have extras, and they are going to get posted in the shop. And I will announce it on Instagram and Facebook. So you will know when they go up, and it is with the foil. So it will be both the foil and the kit. I don't know what I was thinking, but I went a little crazy and I ordered and I ended up like making more than I expected. Like, I don't know. I think I was hoping more people would sign up this month. So I made a lot of extras and I did get signups, but not enough to cover. So anyway, whatever. It doesn't matter. There's extras. So if you're not wanting to do the monthly thing and you just want a one off, they're going to be up in the Etsy shop. Um, Probably very soon. I will announce it on Instagram. And then the last thing was this kit here. So this is just like the daily, so TPC daily, um, the week of the 11th. So the week that my mom is coming, I thought this one from the Tea Light Planner Co. This is the cleaning one because I'm going to be like rearranging the house and cleaning and going through things and doing all the sheets and, the you know, you know, the spring cleaning stuff. So I thought this would be really cute to use for the basically the whole entire week before they come. So that is what... It's going to be used for in my daily planner and I thought these were really cute <laughs> I thought this would go as just on the dividers just to give it like a little bit of sparkle on my daily for my daily cleaning but that is it so that is everything that I'm going to be using for the month of April I think it's going to be absolutely fantastic I love all of these kits some of them have just amazing color it's going to be a beautiful month in my planners and yeah can't wait to share them so stay tuned for the plan with me's keep an eye out for the extras for the flower shop coming to the etsy shop and i will see you again soon have a fantastic day